All right, so we're here at the shop. Today is uh, Thursday the 8th. It is 4 o'clock. Been here for a fat minute. Uh, sold several things so far. i am just been mainly in the back organizing the desk. This area where I have like the soldering kit, the repair stuff, and consoles and anvils that I need to fix. It's been kind of like messed up and real unorganized, but I finally organized everything. I, put everything, I gave everything a spot, I cleaned it up. There's still a few things I have to move here and there, but for the most part, it is organized. All right, so as you can see, I mean, it's still a little stuff here and there that i need to move but for the most part this is my blue pad that i do like battery swaps on or open stuff up and give them cleanings right now this is the next project for me halo 360 controller this one does go with this one down here this is the good working one which i've had so this is the matching controller according to this sticky note lt the left trigger does not work so i'm gonna have to give that a cleaning see what's up with it and also i need to swap out the sticks which i'm going to take care of later and then we got a nice stack of n64 games that do need to be opened and cleaned out because they don't read so i'm going to take care of that when i get a chance but the thing i've accumulated so much of that i didn't even realize were these psps as you can see we have a bunch they all have issues as far as what the issues are i don't remember i don't know if i want to go through all of them again I, I know they don't work for sure because they're all over here for a reason i had them on top of here actually uh these are other handhelds uh this one does work so i'm gonna put this one out these two have issues this one does have a issue as well and then i don't know what's in here i think it's a ds light but as far as these psps they all have issues i don't really know if i want to go through all of them again see if they're fixable i think i'm just gonna list everything on ebay and sell them as uh Sell them for parts as is, just because I don't have time for that. Another thing I do have are these SPs uh, that I'm going to do reshells on, which I'll take care of later. And then, what else do I have here? Some more 64 stuff that I need to go through. But for the most part, this is, you know, it looks a lot better than before. I got the soldering kit right there with uh, some tools and stuff. I'm just trying to stay organized. We also did get a trade-in, so let me go to the front and show you guys what came in. We just got this game in, Need for Speed Most Wanted. Uh, it came to a price, but uh, it was really scratched up, so I was like, I need to test it, make sure it's working good obviously which we do with everything that's traded in and uh, it was not working so uh it, it was really scratched so we brought down the price a little bit and um i took it as is uh just finished resurfacing it it does have the manual inside which is really good i'll be honest i haven't gotten this game in box in years we only get them disc only i've gotten maybe like three four times disc only and uh, we actually have one in stock right now uh disc only which is listed so if you guys are interested in that let us know and now that we have a boxed one this is really good. I just gave it a two minute cycle on the resurfacer, so hopefully that does fix it. If it doesn't work for any reason, it's all good, whatever. I'll sell that one for parts. And then uh, the disc only, I'll box it with this one so we can sell it together. But yeah, it's actually really clean, really good condition. He said he has another copy, which is crazy. Uh, I tried, I'm trying to tell him to bring it in. He said he doesn't have a 360 because it's 360 messed up. I offered him ours, but he said he wasn't looking for one right now. So I'm trying to convince him to, you know, sell us his other one. So we can have two copies, which would be crazy. Excited about this. Gonna go out ASAP to check out our eBay and Instagram links. They're in the description down below. Let us know if you're interested. We are gonna have a boxed copy out available. So regardless if this one works or not, because we do have that other copy. But um, yeah, see how the rest of the day goes. So now that I've made time to really clean out the back, I ended up finding this Halo Reach controller. I didn't even realize we had one, which is funny because you know obviously special edition controllers i love them they sell well for us it is working good so as you guys can see the game is working i'm gonna run a few games on it do a few races make sure it's working 100 percent uh when we first popped it in before we resurfaced it it would uh we'd start the software and it would just go straight black uh show nothing on the screen and it would just stay like that like i said i'm gonna run a few games on it make sure it's working 100 but uh, this will be available asap on ebay in store on instagram so let us know message us if you're interested, we are currently going through a bunch of consoles, a bunch of games, a bunch of controllers that we have in the back that we haven't had a chance to go through. As we're bringing them out, as we're testing them, as we're pricing them, cleaning them, putting them out, I'll show you guys all the items. All right, so we did sell our PSP uh, 3000 model, I think, or was it 2000 model? Uh, this one is our 1000 model that we have in stock. Uh, this one I'm gonna put out right now. This one works good, 100% with charger and everything. The other one sold with GTA Liberty City Stories and a SmackDown versus Raw game, I forgot which year. But that's sold already. Uh, we're going to put this one out. And then we do have two Wii consoles going out. I got some Wiimotes and the Nunchucks. So that's going to be available ASAP. We got an N64 console going out as well. And then we did get two 360 consoles in right now. Uh, I think this one has a 250 gigabyte hard drive. Yeah, it does. Unfortunately, the other one does not. But we got them for a good price. It was... I don't know why I can't close this. It was these two consoles and two power cords 
for 40 for both which is a really good price unfortunately they are pretty worn but i still gotta throw in a controller and uh the av cables i don't think i have any extra controllers but i'm gonna have to see what's up but we're gonna put all this out as soon as possible and then these are a bunch of games that i found in the back that we're gonna process uh nothing too crazy in here just uh, a bunch of decent titles good titles um let's see some madden in there gta smackdown versus raw rock band got some ps1 games if i'm not mistaken in here i don't know we're gonna still have to test it resurface do all that uh once we get everything ready i'll put it out on the floor so we can take a look at it that'll probably be done tomorrow it's already close to seven uh so we're gonna be closing soon but i um, just wanted to show you guys real quick i think i said earlier that i was gonna show you guys all that but just didn't get a chance to because it got super busy but we've been selling a lot next door a lot of stuff has been moving as well i've been trying to list on ebay list on instagram on marketplace all that stuff uh, another thing i did find this psp go in my backpack i've had this for a while this one we picked up at a pawn shop for like really cheap but it is really dirty needs a cleaning so i'm gonna send it to my buddy i just haven't had a chance to pull up over there but he knows i'm gonna be going soon yeah that's pretty much it for right now if anything else goes down i'll turn the camera back on